It's been almost a week since a killer tornado gutted the city of Tuscaloosa and ravaged other parts of West Alabama and the rest of the state. Doctors and nurses at DCH Regional Medical Center have been working around the clock ever since. WVUA's Lindsay Price tells us how they're holding up. My husband asked me the other day, you know, when are you going to sleep? You know, he said, I know you've got to be exhausted. And, I mean, how can you go home and sleep when you've seen what these people are going through? They're not sleeping, you know. And so you just have to do everything you can. We'll rest later. Rest is something hard to come by for doctors and nurses in the Tuscaloosa area after the April 27th tornado. Minutes after the storm hit, Doctors and nurses rushed to DCH Regional Medical Center, where they were met by hundreds of victims. Assistant of Emergency at DCH, Jeremy Pepper, says there was an overwhelming amount of patients. Then, willing volunteers arrived. As fast as we could unload them, we were more waiting to be unloaded. Uh, it was, uh, we had staff, uh, we had numerous doctors from the community that came into the ER without ever being called. They all just showed up to work. After a few overwhelming days, things are calming down at DCH. Now doctors and nurses are moving their efforts into the hardest hit areas to give assistance. We're uh, doing a lot of laceration repair for people that are uh, you know, hurt while they're cleaning up. We're doing a lot of medication refills, um, a lot of medication assistance. Doctors and nurses say that sleep is the last thing on their mind when they see the community they love hurting so bad. And through efforts like this at the Leland Shopping Center, medical workers say they are coming closer together. We've just come together consistently. We haven't had sleep, you know, haven't had the energy to seem, you know, emotionally, physically, and spiritually to just keep helping to keep, you know, to go on. But we've just relied on each other and it's made us a closer unit group. Reporting in Tuscaloosa, Lindsay Price, WVUA News.